An electric motor converts electrical energy into mechanical energy. A generator converts mechanical energy into electrical energy. A hybrid car requires both the motor and the generator. Some systems combine the two, while others keep the components separate. An electric motor and a generator share a similar basic structure. In a parallel hybrid, the drive motor functions as regenerative brakes, producing energy during deceleration. Let's take a look at a typical electric motor. A motor is comprised of a moving component called the rotor and a stationary part called the stator. An electromagnet is created by passing electricity through the coil that is wound around the rotor and the stator. The north and south poles of the magnetic field create forces that push and pull. This causes the rotation of the rotor. The rotational speed of the motor is controlled by the amount of electric current and voltage fed to the electromagnet. Alternatively, when the motor functions as a generator, electricity is produced by the rotor's rotation around its axis. In addition, the mechanical resistance to the rotation is the braking power in regenerative braking. Generally speaking, there are two types of electric motors, direct current and alternating current. The hybrid cars being sold in Japan are equipped with AC motors called the Permanent Magnet Synchronous Motor, or PMSM. PMSM, for the hybrid car, must be small, lightweight, efficient, and powerful. The IPM motor meets the criteria by coupling an electromagnetic stator with a rotor embedded with strong permanent magnets. The IPM motor can produce greater amounts of torque and maintains a constant output at high speeds. These qualities make this type of motor suitable for use in automobiles.